you know, that whole thing with, with the, uh, you know, especially this with the Samoan culture, you know, um, it's not to attend to like, you know, put a slap to the face and then say, hey, we do whatever we want, it isn't that. It's, it's more of a, the, you know, the awareness. We want to share this because it does happen back home in Samoa. It does happen in the islands everywhere. You know, mm -hmm. it's just that, you know, people are hiding from this. And, you know, like we always talked about in the culture, name is very important. You know, it's, it's, the, it's the richest name in, in the Samoan culture in anybody's name, you know? So for that, it's like, you do not want to disrespect your, your family or your people or anybody, you know, because it's disgrace and all that. It's just, you know, that's nonsense. And I think they just need to understand that this is a, it's a new world out there. It's, it's always going to be changing. So it's always going to be changing from everybody. And to that, we, you know, from everybody's point of views is different, like I said, and we, we cannot, you know, judge on them and we, we, we need to like heal them, you know, whatever they're going through, because there is a lot of, you know, kids out there that's damaged from, you know, rape, molestation, you know, mental health, it leads to suicides. That's why we write these kind of stories. You know, it's what it's embedded in their core. So it's very sad that, you know, we see our own Polynesian kids, you know, going through this lifestyle that they're going through and it's unhealthy for them. Mm, yeah. It's very unhealthy for them and it damages their life. When you damage somebody in a young, especially in a young age, just imagine when they grow up. Yeah, it's you know, harder they, to have. Yes, and, and they would never get that kind of help from nobody because they would look at them like, <clears throat> screwed up you know this this kid is nothing he's a piece of crap mm -hmm. he said how how can you do that because we we don't know they say oh that person's on hooked on drugs or that person's into sex and this and that's so, like there's a lot of things you, you got to understand there's a lot of these things happen for a reason for them you know they they've been through some tough times you know so we don't know you know and it's very sad when you see the the suicide numbers go up it's a what what lead them to that?